Hola YouTube, welcome to days 9 through 13. Riding through the city. We're going to the apartment. It's supposed to be pretty hype today. Got out of the taxi beat. It's pretty cool. We are going to the Parthenon. It's pretty chill today, actually. I love the rock tiling of the floors. You can see it now clearly because we're in the daytime. Don't think I ever showed this. I think I showed it on like day three or something, but it was in the daytime. So now you can see it. I mean, at nighttime, so you can actually see it at daytime. Cute doggos everywhere. And then we go to class. Yeah, it's like four, about 14 degrees today, so nice and calm. Somebody's playing guitar down there. Cool. This is like the, the center part. We going left or we going right? Oh, okay. This is cool. This is like a museum shop. You want ISO? And this is like the little carriage spot. We're about to go back to my inside, inside the museum store. This is the map of the whole. She said. Still don't make sense though. Still doesn't make any sense. I don't know if we. So this is for the tickets office, and it's for the Acropolis. How long this line is? This line is going around the corner, through the thing, over the gate, the Parthenon. So many people here. Everybody's in line for the Acropolis. Wow. This is, this is a sight to behold. Hero 7 right there. Oh, new technology. Most people are rocking a 6. This dude's rocking a 7. We in the future right here. Oh, look at these trees over here. So, unfortunately, due to the long ass line right there, as you can see, I think it was like 45 minute wait. And uh, I didn't really feel like waiting. She didn't feel like waiting either. So, we can go back another day that we go to the Parthenon and Acropolis, same day, and just not get out. Uh, so we, today we're gonna go to, uh, I think it's called Placa. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna do it like that. This is actually the top, so you can see the Acropolis from across this little mountain ridge thing. We I showed it like, uh, I think on day three, but you can see it in the daytime. It's cool because people are here now. You can go up the risky route, or you can just do like the nice stairwell. You want to go left or right? So you can see how the rock structure looks. Kind of cool. It's like rocks, beautiful mountains, everywhere. <laughs> You're about to get the coolest view of Athens of all time. Okay, three, two, one. People just chilling out here. It's like a very romantic spot, you know what I mean? Take your girl. Yeah, wow. Look at the mountains in the background. You can't say it's not a beautiful city. That's the library right there. Way out there in the distance. You can see the little mountain village. Look at that zoom though. The zoom is on deck. 
He's on top of the world. This is my favorite city. I forgot the name of it. But it uh has like where where the the really elite people live. And if you zoom in over here, you can actually see that dome building right there. No idea what the name of it is, but it looks amazing. Wow. You can just see the scale of how big Athens is. This trees is looking like something out of an ancient movie. Maybe I like the movie or something. <laughs> I just love the sights around here. The Acropolis. We we're literally the Acropolis. Dawn of civilization is right here in front of us. How legendary is that? Now we're gonna let this guy go through though. Look at that, people will respect too. I like it. Wow. And look, she's pointing out right here. That is the actual epic center part right there people are walking up there you get your pictures in there and this is just a better view the down 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 low view of the acropolis we're hitting it up tomorrow though so it's no worries all right uh now we're headed to the block out the block out now i got google maps on my phone alpha version where you don't even need internet to make it work and somebody's gonna say oh you can download the offline map but guess what this is even cooler than that because sometimes like we were in a car and it was even tracking our gps without internet she was so mind blown and she was like i don't know how you did that and i was like i'm a developer i can do anything this dude's playing an accordion saddest song I've ever heard I'm being honest with you so okay this is on the other side of the fence she said the house is over here in Placa cost around a million dollars which I mean is believable for certain places wow little view Mandarin trees. <laughs> Walking down the epic streets of Plaka, you can see history everywhere from the left side to the right side you got the acropolis in the background you see this epicness like this is what you you come to see when you're here you got the ancient uh buildings everywhere you turn this is the the yep most people don't know that you can actually go in here you're not supposed to be able to go in but we're gonna go in here anyway get the mandarin trees this is where you sneak under with like, you know, like in Assassin's Creed, you go and go under the little thing. Hello. Just wanted to see what was in here. It's just really beautiful. This is the Taberna. There's a lot of food eatery places down the street on the right side. You can't see it, obviously, it's blocked. But um, we're going to go there after it, probably. Get some food. So you can check it out, and you can see that view in the background. We're in the view that you just seen, literally. So, it's gonna be pretty epic pretty soon. I love this tapestry 
<laughs> Mandela pattern. Sorry. <laughs> Fine. Walking down this little alleyway. It's pretty lady people taking pictures and videos of it. It looks like uh it's a lot of like artworks, like one Italian theme going on over here. I, like at the end of the road, like you get transported into like a different universe or something. I can see it. We are close to the placa though, so we are about to be there. Look at that bigness of this. That's like the corner of the Acropolis. Mm -hmm. You got the Greek flag. I told you it was gonna be beautiful when we came over here. Wow. So we had the, the center part of the placa. And you can see, you got views on views. Everywhere you turn. There's like a restaurant back there. I'm like trying to do all three things. We're taking videos. Um, I'm gonna make like an Instagram TV video. I haven't made one of those in like forever. And then lastly, I gotta take pictures, you know? I realized that I'm like, dude, this whole trip, I haven't been really taking that many pictures. So, so I gotta take pictures too. These pictures are a lot easier than videos and they last a lot longer too, so, you know. But wow, this is like that semi Santorini vibes going on a little bit. I like how these shops are very local, to put it in simple terms. What's up Instagram TV? This is Kai Turner. And obviously, as you can see from the view, I'm in Athens. We're in the Placa right now. And it's views on views, no matter where you go. Uh, we're gonna walk right now and show you some epic sights. You can see we got the awesome buildings. You got places everywhere. It's pretty much, it's pretty lit in, in everywhere you go. This is like, showing how rustic it is. It's kind of got a lot of places that are mom and pop stores and then you got like places that are like a lot a lot nicer and stuff like that. It's got that very Italian Greek feel, you know what I mean? It's pretty dope. Mandarins. Wow, I got some jewelry over here. Yeah, the shops. We actually gonna go to the uh, the Parthenon later, and then um, the Acropolis. So that's gonna be a pretty epic video. Most of the, the problem with Instagram TV videos is that I gotta shoot in portrait, which is awkward. Cause I mean, most people shoot like that in in uh, landscape, and I can't just transpose those videos into that because it makes it a lot harder to do. So I'm forced to. She wants to get ice cream. So I'm forced to like make a video that's like, uh, you know, like this. But it's all right. And maybe I'll figure out a way that I can like not do that or make it better. This cool ice cream shop though, look at this. So we know In another part of the placa. We're about to go hit up the Da Vinci. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit y'all when it is. Stores on stores. Look at that booty, look at that. That booty though. What, you think, you think I'm gonna care? I, I did that in Miami. She thought I was gonna be like, oh shit. Nah, you wearing that, you, you know what's up. So you can see the nice sights and ads. Hello. Hey, what's up? Well, hi, everything is okay. Okay. You good? We like to stay somewhere nice. We eat something, drink something as a nice place with a fire. Is that right there? Yeah, my friend. All right, we're gonna, we might check that out later, man. You got Greek people everywhere selling you stuff. This is like New York, but a little bit faster. You know what I mean? It's slower than New York, but it's faster than like, you know, Ohio or something. You know what I mean? Pretty cool. So now we are in the like center. Locker, you can see a lot of nice little fancy restaurants here. They got the awnings. Everybody's trying to get you to come there. It's kind of like Ocean Drive in Miami. 
where you know the, the girls will come up to you and be like, "Hey, c come in here," and they try to you know make you feel all tough so that way you go eat there. It's just like that here. Like people will come up to you and say like, "Hey, come in, come in here." It's like, chill, bro. <laughs> Especially if they see you with a girl, then they know, like, oh, it's your, your easy pickings. Me, I tell them, I straight up tell them, no, like, all right, ain't gonna happen. We, I, I kind of want um, ice cream, but we, we're gonna go to Da Vinci, though, because that's the spot to go to. Wow, look at these art, look at this artwork. Santorini. You got the, the running of bulls. Hedda. It's a lot of dope spots up here. Got some of the cool Athenian dresses here. Pretty dope. It's like a little bit of the past mixed with the future. I used to have to. No, I'm sorry, I'm sorry doing that. Well, this place is nice though. It's called Sasa. Got your little candies and stuff. Little knickknacks, trinkets, tasselets, and such. Plaka is nice though. So look at these sites though. Oh, you see them? Every building is just here. People are selling stuff left and right. Can we go left or right? Watch in Athens. I like the little side corridor streets because they really are saying something. But yeah, we just uh, headed to Da Vinci. Maybe get some ice cream, something like that. Yeah, that's right. You see these beautiful. See how it switches from like coral to like whatever material this is? Wow. We got 18 right 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 where? Right there? Alright, right here. Alright, let's let's get it. This is an international one too, so it shouldn't take too much money, but eh, it's still gonna take like what 20% whatever you put in, so it doesn't make a difference. Let's get that one. Little necklaces. We just got some money from ATM. I love that it always writes like, oh, you're going to get a $3.95 cent fee. I use an international card on purpose and it's still, last time it said like $6 fee or something like that, $5 fee, it was $10 fee. It was $8 plus $2 for the transaction. Like, just be honest with me. Tell me it's going to be $10 so I don't get the money. So that's, that's what upsets me is that they, they just, they BS you and act like it's going to be one fee and they charge you a lot more. But we ain't gonna get it. Like the sounds over here are amazing. I seen that Opera Mail too. I was like, okay. Let's see what we're doing here. A lot of tapestry there. So we're going back to where Da Vinci is near the center. And it is much epicness going on here. After we return, we got shots, little places, little trinkets, stores. City is hella packed right now, we doing it. You see that? The awareness is on deck. A4. You like Starbucks? Wow. Places, faces everywhere. Oh, you got an They got lanes for enough for two people. For people with for like four or five people walking through. Makes perfect sense. Center of the center again. Daytime though. It's always like a musician.
So we outside of Da Vinci, Da Vinci ice cream. She got a lot of balloons. I think she won like a contest or something. I'm just chilling on the table, about to um, get my ice cream. And yeah, the slice is pretty double. Ooh, got a little thing beside. Thank you, thank you. Look at this beautiful ice cream. In da Vinci, Da Vinci. Alright, we're about to go pay right now. Wow. Look at our sparkly nails, though. Oh. There's mine right here. I got the pistachio, the vanilla, and scoop a whipped cream one time walking through the uh, little Parthenon area close to the Acropolis they have the little fire pits here for the dining area and then a little built section on top of the VIP there's another place you can get tickets we realized that you can get tickets for all of it for 30 bucks and Eight for just this museum. And it lasts for five days too, so. Pretty Sean's differently in different lights. It's bluish now, and then it can turn like purplish. I knew my ZD what they would say. Okay, then Athens looks like something out of a movie. But it's not a movie. Or is it? Athens Avenue. This building's tall. We're near Sagaphilus. Favorites right here. It's got that like cathedral style church vibes. A lot of cafes and stuff too. Love that look when the sun's out, but then it's like cloudy up ahead. It's got that like cloudy but sunny look. Babylon nightclub and Athenium. This is the premier hotel here. We got the Ducati on deck. It's pretty sweet. Architecturally speaking, this is some of my favorite. I love the last buildings in this one right here. Wow. I don't think they finished it. They're probably gonna do a little symmetry, isometric shape thing going, but right now they're gonna be done. I love this place right here though. It's really, it's really amazing. They don't have any crosswalks or anything, you just gotta say fuck traffic and go for it. I see you X3. Let's see. Ooh. Fancy paints. This is a beautiful place in general. Like it's like the downtown of any place. Wow, these sites. 
beautiful city. Not bad. All right, here, this is uh, another place to see movies. It's a pretty dope little section. They got Fila and Puma. Where are we doing this at? Uh, basically, all the main shopping center right here is called The Village. Which is ironic because every place has a village that's called The Village. This is like the you know, typical little, little mall that they got. It's indoor though. And then there's like some outdoor sections too. It's in that same vein. We're gonna catch escape room today. And yep, that'll be about it. This mall is huge. It's like the outdoor section. It's got like little tents and stuff. And I'm guessing that red thing is where we're going. Which would be pretty I'm looking pretty darn sexy. <laughs> sexy Maxi out here. It's like the little exclusive section. You know, every place has that. So is that, is that Tower of the Movies? Is that Tower of the Movies? No. Ah. I'm just called a cinemism work, I got you. This is, this is it. Oh, we can get the tickets yet? They got their own gift shop and everything in here. Reception counter. Chilling. It's like a typical movie there, no, not, not too big. Got a hot accountant lady. Ooh, baby. No, I'm joking. Uh, so we're gonna get chips because unlike in America, we got popcorn and we also have chips though. It's ready that. Over here, some ping pong, some games. The game center, obviously, over there. And we're about to go catch the movie. We're a little bit late, but first 10 minutes is always BS anyway, so we're not worried about it. Hello, Cafe. Wow. This is like one of the premier spots. We got a cool little thing. We just seen Escape Room. It was pretty dank. Cool. They got palm trees, got a little Spanish music. It was really cool, actually. A little scary, but honestly, I wanted to see the movie that is. You can write in the comment below if you know what it is. The one with the creator of Get Out, Pill, like he and Pill, but it's like a scary movie where they switch bodies or something. That's the one I wanted to see, but I mean, I'm not mad at Escape Room. Escape Room was pretty good too. I'm gonna Google that though, and figure out which one that was so I can go watch it. Now we're about to go to the fun part and check that out. See what we got going on over there. It's just lights and sounds everywhere over in this little mall. 